All right, everyone, we are back for Hard Justice 2016. Starting off, Bram has his open challenge to start off the show, kicking off. He says, you know how it goes. Any man with the balls to come out, fight me. And out comes the Olympic gold medalist, Kurt Angle. And he comes out to his classic theme song, by Impact Wrestling, of course. And he's going to go one on one with Bram tonight. And Bram was actually able to beat the Olympic gold medalist with a curb stomp tonight. And following that match, Kurt Angle gave him a handshake. And he looked to the Impact crowd. And he had a sign of respect given to Bram tonight that one could only dream of. After that, Alexander Bennett takes on EC3 and manages to make him say, I quit by submission tonight. Following that, Rosemary has a segment where she's hyping up the decay. <laughs> the decay. And their tag team title match tonight. Following that... We have a quick match where it is a battle royale. We see the likes of Shelly, Saban, Conley, Eli. Drake, of course, is the King of the Mountain champion who retains. And he faces a bunch of dummies. Yeah. Lashley, Spud, Trevor Lee, Tyrus, Galloway. None of them could take on the likes of Eli, Drake, because they were all a bunch of dummies. Yeah. Eli Drake, though, got injured with a groin inflammation during the match, though, so we wonder how that will impact him as uh, your King of the Mountain champion. Following that, Eric Bischoff has a segment with Mark Andrews saying, Kid, you got a chance tonight to reclaim the X Division title that uh, you thought you were wronged of last month. And uh, as I replaced Billy Corgan as your general manager, he can sit in an office all day with Dixie doing who knows what in Dixieland. I'm running the show now. I'm calling the shots. And uh, Mark Andrews, good luck tonight. And after that, Mark Andrews is able to defeat Braxton Sutter in a tables, ladders, and chairs match. Mark Andrews retained or was able to obtain the X Division title. Following that, Paul Heyman comes out with his client, Cody Rhodes, and states, Bram was doing an open challenge. I called up somebody who thought he was a challenge for my client. And out comes Brian Kendrick, and Cody Rhodes is able to feed him with a crossroads and send him packing back home. Send him back over to that McMahon company. After that, Gail Kim says that she's been crying all night. She's been just dreaming of a moment to shut up Sienna and solidify that she is the alpha female that Sienna says she is with her big old peacock fair, ferret looking coat. And of course, in our knockouts match, we were able to have Sienna take on Gail Kim, and Sienna actually was able to defeat Gail Kim with the cutthroat tonight. And in a shocking upset, Gail Kim might not be the face that runs the place in the knockouts division. But after that, Mickey James is backstage with Mike Bennett. She's saying how she saw that match between Sienna and Gail Kim, and she was she was disgusted. She thought she could do much better. Mike Bennett says, one problem at a time. There's a moose in the room, and I gotta defeat him before you can go and beat up Peacock's over in the knockouts division and they make sweet love to each other after that we see a shocking victory where rocket ion actually defeat the decay the share brothers and the american wolves to get the world tag team titles and a shocking victory and what has been leading up to for weeks and he ever sustained a grade three hamstring contusion during this match though Crazy Steve felt a little sad that it was a botch. After that, Broken Matt Hardy and Brother Nero, they're talking. 
about how Brother Nero feels like he is becoming someone greater, bigger than the Impact Zone can handle. And Broken Matt says, No, brother. You sit back and watch Baby Maxwell with Vanguard 1 and Senor Benjamin and my lovely wife, Rebby. You sit back and I want you to just enjoy the deletion of Macho Machismo. And that is what happened as Broken Matt Hardy took on Macho Machismo in a last man standing match and deleted him with a twist of fate. But following after that match, Brother Nero attacked Broken Matt Hardy. He got the violin that was played at the final deletion and smashed it over his skull, led blood all over his brother. And Brother Nero is saying that he will overcome Broken Matt Hardy all by himself. That he will conclude his brother. He will end the chapter. He will injure him. He will malm him. It will be the end of Broken Matt Hardy. He will be laid to rest. And then our main event match of the night. The Miracle. Mike Bennett retained the TNA World Heavyweight Championship against Moose. And their ladder match where Mike Bennett was able to retrieve the title. But after that match, Bram came out. He said, I got the respect of Kurt Angle. He said, I'm the man that's going to beat the miracle. I'm the one. I've beaten the Olympic gold medalist. And I'm going to beat the miracle. I'm going to overcome the miracle. And Mike Bennett just sitting there laughing at him. Saying, kids, you don't know what you're in for. And that was... TNA Hard Justice 2016. Ladies and gentlemen, we will see you all next time in the Impact Zone.